people need help, help them. You can't help everybody, so that's the sad part, but we do what we can. Have you heard of the traveling table? Just like the name says, it is a mobile food pantry that serves people in Nampa who may not be able to get to a food bank. So the table goes to them. It's a labor of love for the people who make it happen each month. Maggie O'Mara has the story in our Sevens Hero. Um, just let them know if it's one or two boxes. This is the traveling table. Six or more, yeah. The last Wednesday of each month, is that a box that's done? Yes. Okay. You'll find Anna Morishan. I knew that wasn't for me. <laughs> here in Nampa, organizing another food distribution for the traveling table. Bit more senior bags. Okay. Do you mind putting those together so we can get boxes going? It's kind of like organized chaos, but in the end, we get it done and we feed a lot of families. She's on the board of this nonprofit mobile food pantry and she wears a lot of hats. So when you're done, go get frozen. So traveling table, we just reached our five year mark uh, in January. Do you want to help do some boxes then? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Perfect. We set up here at um, the Vida Nueva church in the morning and in the afternoon we head over to the Nampa Housing Authority. As you can see today, the line is about three blocks deep. There is a huge need. There's a huge need. And then one and one. We have the food that we have gotten from Idaho Food Bank. Hey, can I get a bag of produce over here? We had some food donated from Salvation Army. All right, okay, which car is next? Getting these food boxes into the hands of neighbors in need is the goal. Okay, where are you at? I'm gonna help you carry it. And volunteers are a huge part of it. If you're running boxes, make sure and stop by Anna Maria. She'll give you the frozen stuff. Today, we have Catbed actually helping out. It's always a blessing whenever we can get people to help out. Look at Sandy go, good job. <laughs> Typical box, it's always a variation. We'll have some kind of protein, some kind of grain, some kind of everything from the four food groups. Is that frozen? Yeah. Okay. So you got some chicken in here and then you got some potatoes. Cool. Okay. For Anna, being able to give back in this way is personal. I was raised the youngest of 14 kids. And um, I mean, our, my parents were extremely hardworking, but I mean, food was, you didn't always have the, the cool stuff that your friends had at lunch. Really, it's just about helping. Just helping and seeing like, oh man, these people are living out of their car. Are we getting one more? Yeah, we need one okay. more. When people receive food, I mean, we've seen tears. Did you collect for another family? Yeah, just yeah. make sure and write the name down. Especially senior citizens, that's a huge market that they can't get out. So. Okay, is that done? Yeah. Okay. Anna Morishan and her team plan to keep working hard to keep food on the table for these seniors and families in need. It's a feeling that's hard to describe, but you feel really good being able to just make that little difference. Like to somebody's day, I mean, that could be the highlight of their day. Like, oh my gosh, I don't have to think about where my next meal is coming from. The traveling table. It's organized chaos. We get it done. Yes, yes. We feed families. Okay. Seven's hero. You can donate to the mobile food pantry anytime. The traveling table is always in need of cash donations to buy more food. For more on how to donate, you can go to our story on KTVB.com. The next food distribution will be the last Wednesday in July.